everyone, this is your tower reading for Monday the 25th of April. Let's have a look at what's coming up for you today. And I'm using a new deck called the Wild Wood Tarot, which I feel very lucky to have found. And then I have access to it. It's interesting, isn't it? Because um, I told this story when I first started using the deck, but it's out of print. So some people have really tried it on and have put it online for £9,000. Um, so what's interesting is because it's rare and because it's difficult to get, I immediately value it more. I mean, I love the pictures and the cards, but isn't that interesting? an interesting insight into how humanity works, that if something seems exclusive or very valuable or rare, then immediately we're drawn to it and we value it more than something that's just commonplace. And I think that insight is part of the reading already. So let's have a look at what the, um, the reading is. Ten of bows, ten of wands, and it's responsibility. So you can see someone who's working very hard, and the ten of wands is always about someone trying to hold things together and being very burdened. Okay, So he is burdened, but he has almost made it up to the top, and he will make it. And he's providing wood to the village, and he's taking his responsibilities very seriously. They are weighing him down but they're not breaking him, they're not beating him, and he's able to perform his duties and help other people. So if you feel a little bit bogged down or uh, a little bit like people are really putting too much on you, the truth is that you can take it and that what you're doing is really helpful to other people. So I think good a good way of looking at it is to be grateful that you have the strength and that you have the ability to be of service and that you can help other people rather than grumbling that you have to do all the work and no one else does it. I think it really is appreciated. Your work is appreciated and it's not breaking you. You're able to function. You're able to perform. The next card is the Wanderer, which is the Fool. It's beautifully drawn here. It's, it's this Wanderer crossing this gorge via a rainbow, okay? So by wandering and by having faith, you will be supported and you will be able to get to where you want to go. So again, the responsibility and all of this work that you're doing, you're in a unique position to do it. You can carry these sticks over the rainbow bridge and get to the other side. And you're being supported by your guides, by your angels, by the universe in the work that you're doing because it serves the greater good and it's not just that you have to work like a slave or people are taking advantage. I really think that you're in an exceptional position to do the work that other people can't. So see yourself in that sense that you're really doing exceptional work that other people can't do. So. The way to manage this day is to really tackle and really take on the things that have intimidated you in the past or that you felt has been too difficult for you and there's no way you can do this job. If you tackle it on this day, you'll be able to make progress. So this is an amazing day to uh, take on things that in the past would have seemed much too difficult um, you have the strength and ability to take care of that today finally we've got the green man beautifully drawn here and the green man is the emperor the fourth card of the major arcana and the emperor is the father figure he is the um, authority figure and he represents structure and security and being taken care of so if you do the work one you will be rewarded by the powers that be They'll brew up a special kind of drink for you in their cauldron and present you with something that strengthens you. Or you actually graduate into becoming the green man and you become the authority figure. You become the solid person in charge as a result of the work and you graduate to really being an elder, to being someone who's powerful and in charge and respected. Either way, the way you get to your success is by believing in yourself, 
relying on your own strength, but also the strength of the universe, which is supporting you to do the work, to put the effort in, and it will have a positive, solid, strengthening outcome for you and for other people. Number-wise, we've got 10 and 0 and 4 is 14. 1 and 4 is 5. And in numerology, 5 is freedom. So you may not feel particularly free, but you attain your own freedom through hard work today. And that's where you become, you come to a place of self-liberation. So I hope you have a wonderful day, a wonderful start to the week. Makes sense. Monday, usually you have to take a lot of, take care of a lot of things. But by taking care of all of those things, you really strengthen your own position. Um, if you'd like any more information about your personal circumstances, your working life, if you're in the right job, if you're working in the right way, then please get in touch via the website gregoryscott.com. Click on the readings tab and order your reading there. Remember to subscribe to the channel and I'll speak to you tomorrow.